So now that login and registration are working, let's go ahead and hook it up to our poker program. And I'm going to start with the index page. So this is the main page. And the first thing I want to do here is ensure that I'm in a secure session and that I'm logged in. So even before this header, I'm going to go ahead and require secure. And if I'm not in a secure connection, this is going to immediately redirect back to a secure session. And then I want to require login. And this is going to check to make sure that the user is actually logged in. But the way you can tell whether the user is logged in or not is whether there's a username field and the dollar sign under session super global variable. And in order to access that information, you have to start the session first. So session start. And then this will be able to check whether the user is logged in or not. So this is going to be a pretty simple function. And I'm going to put this in utilities because it's going to be widely useful. So in utilities, say right after require secure, require login. And this is basically just going to say if not is set dollar sign under session sub and then I need the username field. So if it's not set or if it's empty Then I want to redirect to the login page. I just need login page and then exit. And then this login page variable is going to be declared in my page constants. Oops, page constants. All right. So const login page is equal to cis 195p login.php video poker. And if I wanted to get fancy, I could actually use the dollar sign under server request URI to calculate this part of the string. But I'm just going to keep it simple for now. So this function is going to either do nothing at all if the username is already set, or it's going to redirect back to the login page. And then when the user successfully logs, logs in, it's going to return the user back to the home page. So I think I may need some constants files here to make this work. I'm going to need to require once includes page constants. And I'm also going to need includes utilities. So I'm going to need login constants here as well. And I think that should be it. So let's go ahead and try it. If I'm logged in and I hit reload, call to undefined function requires secure. So I need to include. So these requires have to happen above require secure. And this should be fine because they're just defining functions and constants. No side effects, so no output, which means that these header lines can happen here. So that's one of the advantages of not mixing function definitions and constant definitions with code that outputs. Makes it easy to do that correctly. OK, so I'm already logged in, so that's working. And then let's go ahead and clear our 
username session. So I need some way of clearing the username session. And the easiest way to do that is just go to the temp folder in XAMPP. So XAMPP temp. And I'm going to delete all these session files. So now the session has gone away, and if I reload, I get redirected to the login page. So that's actually working correctly.